up that if he would have taken his shirt off, I wouldn't have even enjoyed it. That's how fucked up his character was. Legit. Wait a minute. You, you so mean that's pretty be, good acting then. You yeah, you mean to, up in it. You mean eh. to be telling me that Matthew McConaughey acted? Okay, let me tell you. Let me let me just <laughs> tell you about this scene. The <laughs> so he is like this killer cop or whatever that people hire him. You know, on the hush hush, obviously to killer kill Joe, people. Huh? He's killer okay. Joe. Now, what do you mean by cop? Does he have a badge? Yes. So he's because he constantly by... flashes it with his okay. gun and da da da. And these people can't pay for the money to pay Killer Joe to kill. Oh, this, this is coming chick. back to me. Okay, so they use the sister as a retainer. It's actually Killer Joe's idea to take their sister as his little sex puppet as the retainer fee. Okay. Huh. Let me just tell you, there's a scene in this movie, and he legit, Killer Joe snaps out, and they have Kentucky Fried Chicken, and he asks for, they ask him what type of, you know, do you want white or dark meat? And he says, I want a leg. Then it goes into, he beats the All fuck right. out of this girl. He is holding the leg of chicken in front of his crotch, oh, like yeah. a fucking dick. Like, okay. it is his dick, and legit makes this woman suck it. Suck and she, this is after now, she's yeah. already got blood all over her, like teeth missing, like blood. Just, her face is I fucked say this up. Is finger this, looking good. All right, right. All right, all right. I mean, this movie good was to the last bone. I, was, I got a bone for you. I was completely unaware that Matthew McConaughey did anything like that. That's what I said. Sounds I'm like, like you know, movie. like That's you're impressive. thinking about like how to lose a guy in ten days, failure to launch. <laughs> oh. Like he plays those characters <laughs> typically. So I you, feel like okay, you, Sahara. Uh, so you walked Sahara through Sahara movies. Sahara was so fucking wasted. You're flipping through Netflix. I thought it was good. Come across Matthew McConaughey's <laughs> in this. Let's fire it up. No, and someone had told me about this movie. I'm like, oh, okay. And we thought it was a scary movie. They're like, because he kills these people. Did that mm. totally fucking wrong? Totally See, wrong. You're making me think of Psycho, the new Psycho with Vince Vaughn. You remember mm-hmm. when that came well, they out? They made it shot for shot. I know, I know they did, but Doesn't the fact that seems stupid. Yeah, but I mean, the fact that Vince Vaughn is the guy. Yeah, I mean. It sucked. Don't get me wrong. I mean, it was awful. I didn't awful. Even know about this. Yeah, yeah. Vince Vaughn yeah, well, and, uh, did the whole. Anne Heche was the uh, the girl in it, right? Thank God. I never saw away. that movie. Thank God she went away. Um, yeah. Anne I just Heche remember was. when it came out, they went on and on. It, they did it shot for sh- like they literally. You could hold the original Alfred Hitchcock up to this movie, and, and each scene will be identical. Identical with the frame that they were standing in. But and... why do that? Yeah. I mean, it, I. I mean, first of all, if you talk Vince Vaughn into playing that character, that right there is going to get you. But that's like covering a song and doing it exactly, exactly the same. Exactly the same. Even like. Maybe it was a challenge for the. You know I mean, that, you know I, I get song, it. Uh, My Endless Love. They, no. They use it in that. Uh, uh, Happy Gilmore. Happy Gilmore. Yes. It's <laughs> when they're skating in the, in the rink and it's like. Sing it for my me. love, my love, my. <laughs> In this love, <laughs> and uh, it's got like the. <laughs> it's all coming back to me now. Thank you. Well, that that song was <laughs> Diana. Another great song. That song was Diana Ross, and uh, I forget the guy that sings it with her. And they redid it in the '90s. Mariah Carey and I forget who the guy was again, but Nick Cannon. They did it I- identical to the original. Only now you have Mariah Carey's voice instead of Aww. Diana Ross, which. Mario Carey has a much better voice. Yeah. And I, True. <laughs> I was yeah. actually yeah. driving in the car listening to uh, Sirius XM. They had like the 90s. You ever listen to that? Sirius see. XM? Yeah. You ever... yeah. No. Well, they, they have a 90s channel. And... Every time I ask you to put on the game, you're like, I don't have cable. But yeah, have a Sirius XM. <laughs> <laughs> hey, choose your battle. Hey, yeah, I agree. I, I agree. spend some I time agree. in my car. I want to so, listen to yeah, Sirius XM. Yeah. <laughs> but they do a, they'll do a flashback countdown. Where they'll actually play the, here's what song was it charted at number nine number, or whatever. Yeah. And they'll do the whole countdown, top 40. And that song came on. And uh, I'm listening. I'm like, damn, this girl can sing. Mm-hmm. Fuck, she's got some pipes. And yeah. then at the end, they're like, that's Mariah Carey. I'm like, oh, of course. Yeah. But it was exactly like the original. I don't know why they even redid it, other than to give me that joy of hearing Mariah Carey sing. Yeah. My love, 
<laughs> I, I <laughs> she went into an original thing that I, I've heard I've, I've actually heard that she can actually shatter a wine glass oh. Oh. I know she can break a man's bank account <laughs> oh. <laughs> Nick Cannon look out buddy yeah yeah, it's I don't his think bank it's account. his bank She's account. About. No. Right. <laughs> I got forty-two dollars. Hey. Hey, hey, honey, the residuals came in from your uh, song on Sirius XM. Here's my America's Got Talent uh, money. We'll just put this over here. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe we'll take a little trip or something with that <laughs> to like yeah. St. Right. Louis. We'll, get yeah. <laughs> well, we won't fly first class, of course, but unless you want to get your jet. You know. I'll, I'll chip in for the gas. Uh, jet fuel is so cheap. <laughs> jet fuel. <laughs> How did that relationship even come about? Uh, How did the I, two of them get together? They're like twenty years apart. I have no idea. Well, I don't How know, are they in the Mariah same Carey's room still to get hot. to know each other? I, yeah, um, Is she watching MTV, his shitty show? DJ, he so. was not funny. <laughs> oh, was that the... Uh, they did like improv or like comedy. Oh, it was terrible. Like it was battling. Mm. Like yes. they were like... Oh, man. So, so bad. So, uh, one team more red shirts, the other team more blue. Yeah. Oh, like, that's like... She, it was so probably amazing. MTV. She was probably doing the very last day of yeah. uh, uh, the video countdowns. Right. <laughs> uh, what did they call the show? Uh, True or uh, I don't remember the last time MTV Frick. played music videos. Yeah, Carson Daly. TRL. What the hell? Oh. TRL. Yeah, that's yeah, right. TRL. Total Request. What is it? Total, Total Request Live. Live. Total yeah. Request there you Live. Go. Well done. It was on like every day, like three or something. Yeah. yeah. Right after school. Remember right they after had school? MTV Whoa. Spring Break. Yes. I now, who was the host that? of that oh, show? Yeah. What show? Spring Break. This Spring Break. Oh, they I just had the know. BJs come. No, they, had, they, they had that one constant BJ that was always like fucking ripped on the fucking poolside with I don't know. drinking with ladies. He's like, oh, yeah, come here, you fucking here. Yeah, You're yeah. not thinking of Dan Cortez, <laughs> the host of MTV Sports. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who Dan Cortez is. I have is. no idea who you're talking about. God damn it. You don't remember Dan Cortez? Dan Cortez, no. I remember Kurt Loader. I remember Kurt Loder. Well, yeah. Tab at the Soren. Kurt Loder. Yes. Another news. Another news. <laughs> Kurt Cobain <laughs> is dead. Do they even do that anymore? The news? In TV news. Yeah, but it's all with Sway. <laughs> <laughs> with who? Sway, the black guy with the... Oh, dreads. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. God. I don't have cable, by the way, so it's been a while. <laughs> <laughs> but he's got XM radio. <laughs> <laughs> well, the car came with it. It was capable, and you know, it was yeah. nice. Yeah. Got used to it. Sure. Now Absolutely. you have to pay for it. Hmm. Whatever. I don't have it. The XM radio. No, I'll stick to my iPod. Regular Phone. talk radio. Everything. Yeah. William Barron likes to listen to talk radio. I Shocker. Do. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love it. Same here. You the got, podcast host. What do you got I on there? Can't get on NPR. Uh, I do have NPR. Yeah. Um, I've also got 1470 and 670. Oh, sure. It's always on 96.5. No, it's not always. It's, uh, anytime not I always. drive your vehicle, no. it is already <laughs> on 96.5. Well, that's just the last thing you listen to. There are, it's the only. Yeah, but Jim if you, you got to flip through the favorites. Go. Fuck off. I, I'm so He's sick of hearing He's in his car like eight Madsen. minutes a day, and it's always on 96. He's a fan of the show, by the way. I, I don't care. <laughs> don't even lie. You know you're listening I don't to country. <laughs> Jim, if you're listening, stop listening. Stop listening. Don't say that. No, I you will tell any, him. You don't want any listeners to stop listening. Uh, this guy, I do. Oh, right. He's just right. the most... Right. He's doing I, the best he can. <laughs> Nick Siefkin <laughs> left the show. <laughs> And he's Nick, left to fend for himself now. Nick Seifkin. Uh, no, even before Nick, when they hey, had the other guy. Who would you rather have, Donnie Tillman or Jim Madsen? I don't know, Donnie Jim Tillman. Jim Madsen, 100% hands down. Donnie Tillman was terrible. I didn't even know that guy was black until I turned on the TV <laughs> one day. And he's going, I'm Donnie Tillman. Here's the news. Like, what? That guy's black. <laughs> was it kind of like a Hootie and the Blowfish moment? It was like Carlton from Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Was like, it a Hootie and the Blowfish? Uh, I, I will never yeah. forget that when I found out that yeah. Hootie was black. I was like, what? Who's, who's this guy trying to imitate Elvis? What's that? No, it wasn't one? Elvis. He's what's, black. Eddie Better. What's that other oh. 90s band? Oh. 
that other 90s band where the it was a chick, but everybody was shocked that it was, or maybe it was just me that was shocked that it was a woman. Because <laughs> I always thought it was a man. Oh, God, I can't even think of the song. Hmm. Mm. Uh, nobody knows. Nobody love it. Radio. I would yeah. love to. Right. I would love to know. <laughs> Shut the hell up. You thought it was Asshole. a chick, or you? Thought no, it was I thought a it was guy. a man, and it was a girl. I don't oh, know. you know what? I'll have to research. Are that. you talking about hole? No. No, hang on. There was a song, and this is early, early nineties. Yes. It was she Mr. Been Big. Like seven. No. Hold on, little girl. Hell yeah. No. That's a great cut. No. I thought that was a woman. I, yes. no I even saw the video, yes. and I'm like, that's a woman. She's I always knew that was, I always knew <laughs> it that was, was a man. fucking dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. This was a woman, a black woman, who I thought was a man. Are you talking about the, that O.J. Simpson song? You thinking you about Tracy? Go dream, you better go harder. You better go dead. <laughs> How does that go? O.J. Simpson song? Yeah, I don't they, know. They, they did a spoof about. on SNL about, you better hide in the fridge. You better fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, they did this whole spoof. That sounds like an living color skit. No, no it was, it you was SNL. You better hide in the fridge. <laughs> yeah. Are you thinking of Tracy Chapman? Yes. <laughs> yes. Give me one reason to Cheers. stay here. Yes. That's the I song you thought, thought was, that a was a man? was a man. Yes. She does the... I ride a fast car. Yeah, she's so. Don't not, have money below. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> I always thought that was a dude. You remember driving, driving, there you go. driving in my car. Yes. <laughs> and the radio was on. The move so fast, but you can't look low. Yeah. Bill had on the talk radio. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I always thought that was a dude, and then I was like, "Damn, that's a girl!" Wow. Yeah, she even. Well, wow. she's kind of. Manly. Had the, the short haircut, yeah. she's a little manly. Yeah. But in the, uh, she did the long dreads for the. Yes. Come on, Rizzo, right, right, And she wore right. a blue dress. I think uh-huh. she had enough people telling uh-huh. her, you need a feminine <laughs> you up. Look and then she showed up to the video show, they're like, whoa, whoa, we said yeah. feminine. Whoa, this, this, <laughs> what this, the fuck is no, this? No, this doesn't match, <laughs> lady. <laughs> I, I remember Annie DeFranco. Mm. Who? Wanna She was like the female oh, version of girl. Soul Asylum. I had the nose ring. Oh, no. she was. And Andy DeFranco. Soul Asylum? Yeah. Runaway train, never, never going, going back. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, okay, I know who that is. I just don't know their name. Andy DeFranco looked like the lead singer from that group. Oh, no, she did. Oh, yeah, she did. No. I yeah. can't believe Andy DeFranco's a girl. She, a lot of lesbians Annie, enjoy her first name oh, is I Annie. said Andy. No, Annie. Oh. Annie DeFranco. Okay, okay. There were a couple of tree-hugging chicks. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, that was that the era. I mean, that was. Her. Birkenstocks and the. Oh, yeah. Flannels and one, one, big jeans. One side of your hair still has dreads in it, the other, you're, you're fixing Free. it up. You're not sure what yeah. you're going to do. <laughs> now you just blown out. Deodorant <laughs> or shaving. I shave. Pit hair. You, sh- yeah. you shave one pit, you leave it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, you know, your dread size is long. Yeah. Oh. Whatever. Oh, dread armpit hair. Oh. You can just keep it going. It's a new that's, look. That's amazing. This new look. Ew. Look for it. Look for it on Ew. Kickstarter. We'll we'll get it going. Oh gross! I like that. Oh gross! No, we will not. That's nasty. No. That's friggin' gross. I've never seen a girl. I've seen girls with armpit hair, like the girls that just let it go. Even Madonna like did it for yeah. a little stint. For, yeah, She's but it's always just like a little peach fuzz. It's never like a dude's like <laughs> <laughs> you know like a like bitch, you're giving you know, somebody a fucking like headlock. a three inch long hair coming from their armpit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't Do know, men ever gross. trim their arm hairs? Oh yeah, under arm arm hairs. hairs, underarm, like your armpit hairs. Yeah, I try to say armpit because really? William has a weird thing with the word pit. I hate. What the do you say? Armpit. He doesn't like the word pit. Like we're just, like we just don't underarm? say it. We just, just don't, don't say it in our house. We just don't I, say the word. I don't pit. like armpit. Oh, okay. oh, what about fire pit? Uh, okay, armpit. Then that, I guess the really, pit. it's armpit. It's armpit. He hates. It sounds like it smells. You bought peaches? You know I can't stand pits. <laughs> I don't know why I'm a Jewish guy now. What is this? I don't like arm pit. Pit. No. Arm pit. So I, I usually say underarm. Mm-hmm. There you go. Okay. That's under- how we get around. You the know, arm you, pit. You, you could actually, if you just wrap it up and say under armor, it, well, it's even cooler. Okay. And I get the point. All right. Yeah. Well, I don't ask him if he needs like. Armpit deodorant. <laughs> <laughs> deodorant. That's another one that I can't stand. He doesn't like deodorant either. What do you? Stand. What do you? Why? I just I don't. I don't like the word odor. What do you want to call it? Anti. He doesn't odor? like anything that has to do with his I don't. Underarms. I don't like antiperspirant. So do, do, do you trim your no underarm hair? No. Ever. Never. Oh. Ever. Yeah. yeah, I trim my body head to toe. Do you? <laughs> do you? Do you? God I, damn I'm, that scent. I'm, I'm totally do. I haven't done it because totally summer's do. just starting. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll head to toe it. I want to see your armpit hair. Right now? Yeah. It's long. Oh. 
but <laughs> it's unfortunate. No, I don't. I don't like it to look unnatural. Like I don't want to raise my arm and have someone go. <laughs>